Resume. Zoom. Zoom, zoom, zoom. <laughs> sorry, sorry to hear it. I, I can't work with the. Uh, but if anyone uh, would like to take a video, I would be very grateful because, yeah, it's very important for me. Um, but yeah, so I thought about the theme and uh, basically what my perspective is right now. I'm five weeks in Berlin, all is new. I am uh, so sorry. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's very hard. No, it's hard. Yeah. I mean, um, yeah, I, I feel like emotionally being a little bit stuck in the past. So yeah, it might fit into resume, but yeah, let's, let's just go with it. <clears throat> and then they pat you on the back and say, it will be okay, you'll be fine. Every pain succumbs to time. But what if you like to nurse those open wounds? What if you need to stop the healing because it fell too soon? There are days when life becomes too hard. Then you hear the notion say, I'm waiting for you, don't go too far. And to be honest, moving on is a process that feels grotesque. And every protest lies outside the realm of your progress. So when you are at your lowest, you know there's a shoulder that lingers for you to put your head on. The warmth of past memories that keep you stuck. The harsh dark fantasies that make you feel luck. Be honest to yourself, aren't you fucked? Sun rays touching your skin are rare and it is with bare hands that you try to dig yourself out. But out of despair you are unaware that there lies that which you cannot repair. In what manner can you endeavor in new things when the old ones become a home that you need no matter what the truth is? There's no way to be in or out of it. It's fluent. Your superpower is wearing a smile, just not showing it. Jeez. Owning it, embracing the bad. That is, you feel degradation in all that you expect. In every aspect, you try to skip to the next track, but to again, you are stuck. Oh. I swear, I'm missing her. In my mind, she's still here with me, even when she's there. I don't know where or if I will let her go. Is it my choice to say? The last time we talked is more than a half year ago. She was a light that helped me up in my worst time. By my side, she gave and went away, took life. She was my tight. Now I am the waiting, sure, at which she will never arrive. I know it's selfish and I'm the addict who keeps mourning his inability until it's too late for the exit. So they can keep petting you if you're not keen enough to settle a new. Yeah.